You're listening to E-Commerce Fastlane, the podcast show to help you build, manage, grow, and scale a successful and thriving company powered by Shopify. Listen to real conversations with partners and subject matter experts as they share proven practical strategies, platforms, and the best Shopify apps to help you accelerate your business. The time is now for you to improve efficiencies, grow revenue, profit, and lifetime customer loyalty. Please welcome your host, startup founder and strategic advisor, Steve Hutt. Well, welcome to E-Commerce Fastlane. I'm your host, Steve Hutt. And today we're joined by Gene Ginsberg, who's the founder and CEO of the Gift app. That's G-I-P-H-T, the Gift app. And they're a Shopify app and they really are revolutionizing the corporate gifting landscape. Now we had Jean on the podcast recently and I'm really excited to have her back again and talk about a very relevant topic. You know, with the holiday season here right now, we're all sending out gifts and with our digital nomad lifestyle and trying to keep track of everybody's current shipping address, I know is hard and often we have to spend so much time collecting shipping addresses just for this gifting or even worse, you send the gift out, but it's returned because the address is incorrect. And that kind of ruins the whole gesture in the first place. But Gene's app gift, it certainly addresses this exact pain point. So let's jump in and learn more. Well, hi, Gene. Welcome back to e-commerce Fastlane. Steve, I'm so excited to be back here on the podcast. Thanks for having me again. Gene, could you give us an overview of the gift app for Shopify stores and explain why now right now because we're in q4 right now i think we all kind of know the answer but i want to hear it in your own words like why is now a great time for merchants to want to implement your solution sure i would love to share and just for anybody who didn't listen to the first episode of the podcast oh. about gift i'll, I'll kind of go back into the background and so why the app was created and really the pain point uh were what i created the app initially was that before the pandemic, you can send business gifts to clients, colleagues, partners very easily, right? And a lot of us work from the office and you can send gifts to the office, no problem, whether that's for the holidays or thank you gifts or whatnot. But after the pandemic, now that a lot of us are working from home, it became more challenging to send gifts to private homes because you don't know the shipping address. Also, Especially for the holidays, it became more challenging because now as a business owner or let's say an administrator at a business, you have to collect a lot of these shipping addresses, right? So you might have a hundred clients as a business. So you have to go out and collect a hundred shipping addresses, which just becomes very cumbersome and time consuming. And so the reason why now is the time for any merchant who's listening to this episode to download and install uh, the gift app on Shopify is we are right in the midst of gifting season. And if you want to capitalize on the billions of dollars that are going through the economy now for holiday gifting, this is the perfect time to download and install the gift app. Well, now that we understand the problem that your app solves, can you share with our listeners how the app actually works with a Shopify powered store? Absolutely. I'd love to share how the gift app actually works. So in terms of the merchant side, as a merchant, uh, you can go to the Shopify app store. It's a public app and install the app. It takes 10 minutes to install the app. We also have support tech resources if you need any support, absolutely free for you to use. So as an end user, if I were on your shop, I would pick a gift on your Shopify store and add it to the cart. And then on your checkout page, once you install the gift app, there's going to be a button, like the gift button, and it'd say, it'll say something like send gifts with email. And of course, that text is customizable. We can make that whatever you want, but typically it will say send gifts with email. And there's a little graphic underneath that that basically goes into how the gift app is, can be used by the end user. So that way end users are not confused to say, you know, which button they're pressing. Of course, the user can use the regular Shopify checkout process, which is, well, we all know how that works. But once they click the sent gift with email button, then, then they will be taken to our gift page. And it's a very easy process. So all they do is add in their name and their email address, the recipient's name, 
in the recipient's email address. And there's a little note at the bottom that you can add as an end user. And then after that, it just goes back to the Shopify checkout process. So it goes back to adding in the billing address and adding in the credit card and completing the transaction. And then after that, your recipient will receive an email and they can click a button there and then just add in their preferred shipping address. That shipping address goes back to you, the merchant, and then the merchant fulfills and ships the gift like any other order. Now, gifts can be sent one by one quite easily, but I understand that there is a bulk gifting feature that's kind of baked right into your solution. Can you share some details about, number one, like why you built this option? And number two, how exactly does it work? Yes, Steve, this is a feature that's been requested by merchants time and time again. And so this was the first big feature um, that we built out after the minimum viable product that we built out last year. So the process is exactly the same in terms of how it starts, right? A user would go to your website, they would choose a gift and add it to the cart. And then they would click the button that says send gifts with email. And then once they get to our gift page, um, in the previous question, I kind of went through how it works with one-to-one gifting, you know, add in and uh, uh, the sender's name and email address. And then instead of adding in just the recipient's name and email address, there is a multiple recipients feature button that's also on our page. So when a user clicks the multiple recipients button, <clears throat> it takes them to a pop-up, which uh, there the sender can then upload a CSV file of names and email addresses. We also now have features, added features for text messaging. So you can add it as the end user, as the sender. You can add in names, emails, or phone numbers for text messaging. And our system will actually pick up, it will understand, it will kind of pick up based on AI that this is an email address, this is a phone number. So you don't even need to specify, you know, as the end user, as the sender. Um, and then just gifts will do the exact same thing. So it will collect all those hundred email addresses of recipients, send those hundred emails, and then collect the shipping addresses one by one automatically, which then uh, goes into the merchant's admin, Shopify admin, and then merchant fulfills and ships the gift like any other order. Now, since our last conversation, how has the user feedback kind of influenced the continued development of the gift app? Like, is there any notable feedback from, you know, current customers that led to a significant change or an addition to your solution? Happy to share the feedback that we've gotten from both merchants and end users in terms of how uh, that feedback has influenced the development of the gift app. So one of the things that we've definitely had to lean into with this app or any other product is just listening to your customers, what they want, how they want to use it, what's easy for them, uh, what's the best way. So that's definitely been an important piece is just listening and updating the apps for uh, based on the feedback. Uh, For merchants, um, the biggest feature request that we got over the last year has been the bulk ordering. So a lot of times gifting, um, gifting merchants, do business gifting uh, orders for the holidays. And so they might have a client that's a professional services client, and that client might have 100 customers that they need to send out holiday gifts for. And so instead of doing one-to-one gifting or you know 100 transactions with 100 different shipping addresses, our gift bulk feature allows you as the sender to upload a list, a CSV file of names and then corresponding email addresses or phone numbers to send out 100 notifications via email or text. And then the recipient will then receive that email and add in their shipping address. That shipping address goes directly to the merchant for fulfillment and shipping. And then on the end user side, we really wanted to enhance the communication and allow end users to really understand how this gift app works or how the gift feature works. It is a new way to send gifts, right? This is not something that's been around for a long time. Traditional gifting has always been, you know, collect the shipping address, send the gift. But now this is a new way of sending gifts, which is very exciting and very cool, I think, and very easy and frictionless. And so we just created some communications and graphics around during the user experience for end users to really understand how the app works. So those have been really the two 
biggest features that we've been requested, that has been requested from us. Now, since I know your solution well, I'm going to peel back a few layers and, and ask, like, how do you measure success and the impact of the gift app? And maybe from both angles of both the merchant side and their customers. Absolutely. Uh, success metrics are very important, right? What's the point of having any product if you can't measure or understand success? So with the gift app, we have two sides of the coin, right? We have merchants and we have end users. And for merchants, our success metrics are really increasing sales and conversion rates. According to a Baymard Institute study of 12 years around conversion rates, up to 15% of users abandon their carts, their e-commerce carts, because they don't know the shipping address or don't have it handy. So with our solution, the gift app, that takes care of that 15%. So imagine if you're the merchant and you lose 15% of your users because they're abandoning their cards. So imagine bringing 15% back of sales into your pipeline, into your revenue base every year. So that's a pretty big chunk of change. And then in terms of end users, we're really focusing on business owners or salespeople. And the gift app is a way to maintain and uplift client and business relationships. So the success metric there is customer or client retention. So we, of course, want the end users to continue to have great business relationships. And so we would measure, we measure success that way with our end users. Now, as we wrap up today's show, what final thoughts would you like to share with our listeners? Well, we are super excited about the holiday season coming up here. And if you're listening to this podcast... Um, hopefully you've had the opportunity to download and install the gift app uh, if you're a, a gifting merchant. So we're just very excited about the opportunity. I think that email-based gifting is going to be the next big breakthrough in business gifting and just gifting in general because it's such an easy and frictionless solution. So we're just very excited about the future. Now, Gene, what would you recommend as the next steps for listeners who want to, number one, either learn more about your solution or want to implement the gift app? If you're a merchant, if you're a business gifting merchant or a gifting merchant, uh, this solution is perfect for what you're doing, especially around the holiday season. So you can go to the Shopify app store and just put in gift, G-I-P-H-T, and you will find our solution. It takes five or 10 minutes to install the app on your shop. So it's very quick and easy. There's no long integrations or any sort of, you know, long processes. I know other apps, that's the case uh, often. So we made this super easy for merchants. And we also have a support tech resource. And so if you as the merchant don't want to install the app, um, we can do this very easily for you. And then for anybody listening who is an end user or does holiday gifting for their business or whatnot, you can go to our website, gift.io, G iPHT dot io and we also have a marketplace where you could uh, we list all of our merchants and you can just go there pick a, pick a merchant or category and then pick your gifts and use our gift app so that's the best way to learn more about the gift app now, Shopify's mission is to make commerce better for everyone and it's very clear to me that you and your team are tightly aligned with that vision you know you're contributions to helping Shopify brands, you know, and partners in the ecosystem really are impressive. And I just want to thank you personally for sharing your expertise and your insights, you know, with our community today. It really, it's been a genuine pleasure having you on again. And I wish you tremendous success this holiday season. This has been great. Thank you so much, Steve, for having me on the show twice. Um, I hope this was informative and insightful for your audiences. And um, I'm very glad to be here. And it's been such an honor and a pleasure uh, being your guest twice. Thank you so much. Well, that wraps up today's episode of e-commerce fast lane. You know, thanks to you for being a loyal listener. You know, we produce this podcast to arm you with the growth strategies, actionable tactics, and kind of the insider tips from the best in the Shopify ecosystem. And each week, really is crafted to edge you one step closer to growing and scaling a wildly successful direct-to-consumer brand. And your investment in time and listening and learning is deeply valued. And I know you have a growth mindset and are a constant learner. 
that in itself is very inspiring. I truly appreciate your journey, whether you're a founder or a marketer. So go on, enjoy the rest of your week, implement the gift app, and remember, keep thriving with Shopify. Shopify.